Epcot for the very first time as annual pass holders and check out Spaceship Earth in the background. So cool. It feels surreal, right? Right. Here for the first time. Like literally, like, we had dinner at home, walked the dogs, and now we we're at- here, we brushed like, our teeth. <laughs> yes, that was the- <laughs> That was the sequence of events, but but I mean, like it's just crazy. Like we live here now, so we can do this whenever we want. It's wild. If you can believe it, Justin has apparently never done Spaceship Earth before, so we're gonna go do that. Uh, where oh. where in China are you from, How Justin? Is Why? I did like that. <laughs> Okay, uh, I'm from, uh, okay. No. So, quick thoughts on that ride. Um, I feel like I didn't need to go to school. I learned <laughs> everything I need to know about the entire world. I'm exactly. changed, man. It is starting to rain a little bit, but we're gonna go on Soarin' right now. There's like a 10 minute wait, so I think that it's gonna be like a walk on. Going on Soarin', Justin's only ever done the one in California, right? Yeah. yeah. It's like the lovely uh, Eiffel Tower. Yes, absolutely. Excited for your flight? <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be a two and a half hour delay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, lost your bag. If they really wanted to give us the real experience, that's what they would do, yeah. right? Yeah, and then they'd make us wait and they'd crank the heat up so that we were just as uncomfortable as possible. Yeah, you're right. This is and there'd be a not guy stuck in the bathroom for two and a half hours as well. Yeah, well, you also had to really go, and then when you finally got to go to the washroom, you couldn't go because you'd be like, Ew. You did your pants already. Oh, God. <laughs> This was like literally a walk on. No, not literally. No, you're right. We are waiting for like a minute. We're waiting for a minute. We'll point you with some important safety information. We're at the World Showcase right now, and we're at the Canada Pavilion. Yeah, the spirit jersey is kind of cute. I wonder how many people like actually get that. I don't know, guy. We ran into some nice, friendly Canadian cast members. They were Canadian, so that means they were kind of weird, but. Oh, Justin. Well, we're all weird. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we're all weird. Hey, American spilling now. Justin's looking for something to drink. I'm looking for something to eat because I'm a little hungry. I'm trying to find something on one of the booths because I want to try something different that's like not here all the time. But we haven't really had any luck so far. So on the hunt we go. So we've walked all the way to Germany and we still haven't found any food or a drink. Oh, I'm from malnutrition. Yeah, all because we, we walked all across North America and Europe. Because we literally just became pass holders, we didn't know, but the cash member at uh, the shop told Justin that there's a 30% discount right now for annual pass holders. So, yeah, it just started on Monday. So, if you're an annual pass holder, now, now is the time to purchase. Yeah. Now things are only slightly too expensive. Yeah. We really already passed by the Mexico Pavilion, we're almost back in Canada, and I finally found my plant-based food option like an impossible chorizo. So that's what I'm gonna eat. That's what I'm gonna try. There. Hi, how are you doing today? Hey, how are you? Good. Can I get the impossible chorizo? Yeah. And you can get it It smells like ketchup -y is what it smells like. Yeah, to be fair, I can't handle spice very well, but wow. That, that's very spicy. You're crying. That's really yeah. spicy. Really? I would not recommend that for kids. It's not terrible, but it's really spicy. And it, that's really the only taste that it has, is just spicy. How spicy is it? It's a spicy. So for that being the only plant-based option that I could find, honestly, it was a little bit lame find that there was like a whole lot of flavor to it other than just it was really really hot and 
like it was just okay. It wasn't terrible, but I'm definitely not craving it and like running back here anytime soon to go get it again. It was still pretty good, and honestly, it was really cool to walk around the world showcase and just like check it all yeah. out, right? It came up to like what three bucks? Yeah, it was like I think it was like four dollars in some sense, especially because we got the annual pass discount as well. So, I mean, honestly, you really can't go wrong, and especially for me, I don't eat a whole lot, so I didn't even finish that whole thing, and I am like pretty full. So, I mean. You know, pros and cons. So we're gonna go do Journey into Imagination with Figment, like right now. And also just has no idea what to expect and I'm really excited for his reaction. Hey, how's it going? Good. And then all these famous scientists, you'll love this, Justin. We have inventor of Flubber, inventor of the shrinking ray gun and Figment. <laughs> no idea what to expect. Oh, I can't even contain myself for your time. Yeah, I know how I can say this. They're so sound. Touch. 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 Taste. Taste like chicken. Can I go? Please, please, please. No, I don't want you out of my sight. Oh, I love it. Tickle testing in progress. Uh oh. Upside down. Upside down. Imagination is a Think of that. Um, I think you may have overhyped it a little bit. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we didn't do like the you know e ticket attractions here, but we did get to do like three rides and we walked around World Showcase all just this evening. Like, we got here at like what seven o'clock, seven thirty. Well. The winds were blowing north at about yeah, it was uh, like 7 o'clock. miles per hour. It was like 7 o'clock. It was about 7.04 based on my prediction. It's like not even 9.30 yet, so I feel like I had a pretty good time. I feel like I had a pretty good time. <laughs> I feel like I, I had a pretty care. good time, gay. Hey, you in tonight. Tune in. Uh, well, do tune in. Tune in to our channel. So I think that's going to be it for us for tonight. We did a bunch of rides, had a blast, and yeah. If you have not already, please like and subscribe because as we mentioned, we literally just moved here. This is our first time in the park as AP, so we're gonna be filming and putting a lot more videos online. So stay tuned for more.